Vault Hunter. I got the fire in my breast and a gun in my hand. We gonna take back the last key fragment, and I figured out where it is. The Jacob's Powder Cellar. I'm sorry, Powder Cellar? Well, that's where my family cascades our signature gunpowder. My father must have hidden the fragment in a barrel of Grand Reserve black powder before the Calypsos arrived. Clay knows a secret way to get in. Go and meet up with him. This'll require a two-pronged attack. Vault Hunter, while you infiltrate the cellar, Alistair and I will slip past the Harpy's Zealot Guard. Tonight, we take back Jacobs. Here, here. I'm over by the waterfall when you're ready, Vault Hunter. Hunter. I cannot excuse Aurelia for what she's done to Wainwright and the people of Eden Six. She must answer for her crimes, but she is still my sister. If I could speak with Aurelia face to face, I might convince her to surrender. Enough blood has been shed, and sometimes the bonds of family can be repaired. I ask only for a brother's chance. Ugh. Vault Hunter. Follow my lead. Montgomery Jacobs showed me this little side entrance back in my smuggling days. He was a great man. And I owe it to him to see that the Jacobs Corporation gets back in Jacobs' hands. Wainwright will make a damn fine head of the company, assuming any of us make it out of this alive. Let's get a move on. Here we are. Really? Secret tunnel behind a waterfall? Yeah, Jacob's family loves their secrets. This passage will put you right underneath this state. Stay smooth, operator. That passage should have put you smack dab in the powder cellar. The barrel delivery pipe ain't far. Get moving and watch your stray shots. <laughs> Dr. Z here, selling shields, mods, and peace of mind. Pieces of brain, too, if you're buying. Most archers got a degree to pay off, but I pass those savings right to you. Kaboom! Run a tat tat! <laughs> <laughs> 
power. Reloading. God damn, I love me some junk.
to unleash this power. Stay away from my junk, witch! Yeah! Why not? Definitely not the right one. Damnation. Alistair, look around for clues. I found a stuffed fish with a code on it. 
That'll be the answer. Alistair, read me the clues and I'll solve it. I'm hardly in the mood to... Oh, fine. Here, Eagle Crab 7 Windigo. This is the fun part, Alistair. Try and enjoy it. There, the code's in. Vault Hunter, hit the request button. This time for sure. Still no. Hells, bells, the fist was a red herring. Watch out for more zealots, Vault Hunter.
best is not enough. Honey, will you please hurry up with this? I do not relish the notion of a confrontation with my sister. God damn it, Alistair, my father's dead, my company is in the hands of bandits, and I'm trading away my inheritance because I had to save your life. If I have to enjoy myself while solving the last puzzle my father left for me, I damn well shall. I... you are right, I'm sorry. So in that case, I should not point out the code written on the ceiling. What? Oh, damn. Blue lever, white button, brass chain. Alistair, you beautiful bastard. This is it. Vault Hunter, press the button. Got it. The Grand Reserve. Ha <laughs> ha, what'd I tell you? Easy as pie. Key fragments should be right inside. A team success is what that is. Now we can open the vault. Come meet me and Alistair near the gardens. I'll open up the way for you. Just follow the conveyor system out of that room. Bullets and bombs. Shoot more, sharp markers.
Aurelia, as your brother, I implore you to stop this. Step aside, Alistair. Well, I trim the last loose end of the Jacob's lie. If you want to kill Wayne Wright, then you will have to. Yes, I know.
weak. Diadems are a girl's best friend. Are you all right? Me? What about you? You were shot just as much as I was. Oh, I'll be fine. Not the first time I've had lead in my belly. Just have to clench. Ha! Oh. Thank you, Vault Hunter, for giving her every chance and for humoring a blinded fool of a brother. You're both looking a bit worse for wear. We will survive the trip back to the lodge. It's up to you to finish the task, Vault Hunter. Right, the vault. To reveal the entrance, you'll have to solve some light statue-based riddles out in the gardens. Should we really be solving puzzles right now? Oh! Oh, I do apologize. Are you hearing this, Alistair? The Vault Hunters lost all whimsical intrigue. Forgive Winnie, he gets cranky when he's been shot. Do just try solving the riddles, Vault Hunter. The first statue is out there on the terrace. You just have to recreate how the subject died. Once you clear the path to the vault, I will join you with the rest of the vault key. Just need a walk to clear my head is all. Gardens always take the weight off a little. Something about looking up at a gallery of brilliant fools who got it worse than me. <laughs> it's nice to know I could piss it all away and someone out there would still be dumb enough to carve a statue of me. <laughs> still, I wonder what Wainwright will have to remember me by. <laughs> what even is a legacy? In
for? Is it the house you built or the bodies buried underneath the lawn? Montgomery Jacobs. You've been ignoring my offers. I don't like being ignored. That's the founder himself, Singleton Talbot Jacobs. Quite the eye for detail he had, even if it caused him to miss the big picture. Listen to the recording for a hint. Yeah. Singleton was keen with tools. He kept a wrench in pocket to finally tune the tools of war that caused his sails to rocket. He peered too near at a marksman's gear, and the bullet went right through his socket. Singleton was keen with tools. He kept a wrench in pocket to finally tune the tools of war that caused his sails to rocket. He peered too near at a marksman's gear, and the bullet went right through his socket. Singleton got held up, and all he cared to do was inspect the bore of the robber's rifle. That is, until the robber shot him in the face. Head to the menagerie next. Didn't break a sweat. Menagerie was installed by my great uncle Maddox. Maddox didn't trust a soul. The man preferred having bars between him and the rest of the world. He once measured his spaghetti on the suspicion that his cook was short noodling. <laughs> Be 
feels so good. Nothing to it. man who never left his room. The outside world was full of those who surely meant him doom. While his concentration was on ruination, the gun at his back went kaboom. Sounds like he was shot in the back, doesn't it? Spent so much time looking out the window, he never noticed that his butler was plotting his demise. Oh, uh, got the drama. The final riddle is in the greenhouse. <laughs> Huh? 
Merde Jacobs. He catches up to me and demands to know where I was going. So I say, you know where I'm going, Monty. Then I hear the click of a pistol chamber, and he says, Jacobs might have escaped the big war, but the next one is coming. The war of the vaults. Good thing there's no vault here, huh, De Leon? I nod slowly. And if the great Typhon De Leon couldn't find that vault, no point in anyone else looking. He smiles and hands me a solid gold revolver. Pleasure doing business with you, De Leon. dump ever. There are some men who excel at any task laid before them, and Typhon de Leon is one of those men. <sighs> Your loot, Vault Hunter. some floors to show off his great profit. So burnished was the catwalk that he stepped and slipped right off it. The worst of the falls went right to his balls. The damage was catastrophic. Warden tripped in the factory and died. Uh, well, the doctor had to invent a new name for his injury. Called it fatal testicular devastation or some such thing. An innovator till the end, my grandpappy was. See, you sniffed all those riddles out like a saurian in heat. Head back to the terrace. There'll be a switch to reveal the entrance to the vault. See, Winnie? The vault hunter enjoys solving elaborate puzzles as much as you do. Yes. Yes, I do suppose the heart of an adventurer still beats within you, vault hunter. Was there ever any doubt? Never question me again. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah. <laughs> 